back to my channel so today i'm showing you how to make this card so i'm using a sculpted edge card base this is i think six by six and then i'm taking the shopping alley stamp from la la land crafts and i'm making this card for gabby from 88 and clear um so i watch 88 and clear go live and i think i came across it one day by mistake i don't think i was actually meant to click on it um and generally, I don't know if anybody else is like this, but if I join a live and I comment and I don't get a response from that person, like, all the way through that, like, live, then I kind of don't go back into watching them because I think, you know, even though you're busy doing something, there's no reason for you not to respond to the people that are supporting you. Um, but they responded every time I commented and it just made me feel just like a part of what they were doing and everything. And I have to say, I do not regret accidentally going on that live once. Um, so if you're part of my card groups, then you will obviously see sometimes there'll be a link posted for the live. And honestly, it's probably the best thing. Anyways, I'm just colouring this in. So I went onto her Facebook page because we're friends. And I just found a picture of one of her outfits that she had on. Um, the only difference was she was wearing shorts, not jeans. Um... Because obviously she lives in Arizona, which is really warm, so, but that's the only difference. Anyways, I'm going to insert some music and I'll speed this process up and I will talk to you again when I start to do some embossing. Once I've done that, I'm just stamping my sentiment. My sentiment is actually from a Colorado craft company. 
um, stamp. I can't remember off the top of my head, but one of the stamps is from one set, which I think is called Thinking About You. I'm not entirely sure. Do not quote me. Um, and the second one I use is actually from the Colorado Craft Company Perfume Bouquet. So I'm using Cosmic Shimmer in Bright Silver. I think it's called Bright Silver. I don't know, it's linked in my description anyway. You get a set of three, you get the silver, the gold, and then the copper. Um, like I said, this is my go-to embossing powder. Um, the one thing I have noticed though is I tend to get some bubbling like in my embossing and I don't know if anybody else experiences that and if it's normal or not, so I do need to look into that. But yeah, so I will link ADAD and Clear down below guys so you can go and check out their Facebook page, um, they are on Instagram, but I'm not going to link every single thing, it's just hard work, um, but they do go live every, I want to say Tuesday and Friday, but if you're in the UK like me, it is actually Wednesday morning and then Saturday morning, so it is a couple of times later, but yeah, anyways, so I'm going to heat set that off to the side. And then once I've done that, I'm bringing in my other sentiment, which says you are fabulous. So I think what people don't understand is like the what goes in behind the scenes for videoing. Um, like I do, obviously I do YouTube, so I know like I have to get all the links. I have to make sure the camera's focused. I have to make sure it's recording. I have to make sure every little detail is just right and that's what ADA and Claire do. So Richard is actually the card maker and his wife, Gabby, is the behind the scenes. So she reads all the comments out to him while he's creating so they could interact with us. And honestly, the amount of work she does is amazing. She is an inspiration for me. Anyways, um, I just used Vintage Rose to add some embellishments. And I've also brought in my Spectrum No Sparkle pen, as you saw, along with my white gel pen. But that is it for the video guys, if you enjoyed make sure you like and subscribe, follow me on my social and go and check out 88 and clear. Otherwise guys, I will see you in my next video, stay safe and happy crafting!